Hello everybody, welcome back to Arkham Asylum. We're at part 5, uh, the penultimate part of Arkham Asylum. Same crew, uh, and uh, we're hacking a wall. All the same bat time and same bat channel. Yep. With our bat scope. Yep. Realized I had the volume a little too loud, but that's okay. So, uh, it's been a while since we've recorded Arkham Asylum. Uh... Not a lot of Batman-related stuff has happened in the time since we last recorded, so... I don't think there's anything relevant for us to talk about right now. Uh, Wait, though... I thought these were all recorded on the same day. Oh yeah, you're right, I'm sorry. I, I had a slip no, up there. Man, no. Did Batman just destroy some Arizona tea? What? Okay, I wasn't the only one who was, like, off-put by the shape of what he was blowing up. Hmm. The fucking the battery thing that he was exploding. That shit hurted. Oh no, we're going to get injected with uh, the green. I feel the COVID juice. Oh god. This is what COVID does to you, children. It turns Ready you into the clown incredible Hulk. <laughs> Do that. Well, it just did. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, brief story recap. Dr. Young has been killed. Her Titan formula has been stolen by the Joker, which is clearly on display right now. <laughs> I'm getting decked in the face like an idiot. Hey, is it? I'm sorry? Their spines are exposed. Just tear them out. Oh, yeah. They totally let us get away with that in rated T game. Um, yep, and we're currently looking for Poison Ivy. Okay, Ugh. some point looks like it's running so, like, on slow motion. Like that. Maybe because of your kin uh, your kinetic kitty and internet. Well, I mean, but legit, like that dodge, roll. that dodge roll right there. Oh, if you batarang the, if you batarang the big guy. Uh, everything slows down because it's like, oh, the, the, the big guy's confused. I okay, see. Kind of gives you enough time to dodge out of the way. I gotta go move. You can climb their spines. And control them. <laughs> what is this, Crash of the Titans? I know there's a few games that let you do something. I don't play much. I can't remember what it was off the top of my head. I just said it's stupid. <laughs> it was. Oh, I'm thinking of a different one. I'm thinking of a different one. I think it's back. I think I'm just thinking about McDonald's for some reason. I want McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to McDonald's while these guys while these guys are in the RV. Do you think Joker worked at McDonald's because he's a clown? <laughs> I think um. Oh my God. I think I forget what YouTube channel it was. Maybe Studio C, but they made this whole parody about Heath Ledger's Joker being the new Ronald McDonald. Oh Would you like to try a Big Mac sandwich, Jared? If you <laughs> have. <laughs> Future Jared, if you have the patience to find it in the future, uh, insert a clip of that here. Thank you or fuck it, you, though. Future Jared. It all depends on what he does. He also drew three bats. He's an artist. He has. Don't judge his work. His detective work. He has a passion for drawing bats. <laughs> Please be nice to his art on DeviantArt. He does special doodles. You think Batman would draw fetish art? Let's not... <laughs> Let's not go anywhere further with that. This is me kissing Catwoman. <laughs> I was gonna say something Catwoman related, I forgot what it was. And then... <laughs> Good. Good. Do you think Batman's gonna watch Bambi? No. No, we are not. We are not. <laughs> Bringing no. Bambi into the fucking thing. No one knows the fucking context for Bambi. Bambi. 
A lot of the shit we say, nobody gets context for. Yeah, fuck them. We ain't gonna give them the context of the Bambi, no. the hour-long no, Bambi Tyler. conversation. Tyler. What? I think fucking Batman already lived through Bambi. He uh... he lived he he lived through like more than half of it. So basically, he was double Bambied. Yeah, instead he, Bambi only lost his mother. Double Bambi. He didn't lose his father. What the fuck? You know, Master Bruce, why don't you take the fucking bat plane and fly to where Poison Ivy is? Or, you know, just grab this upgrade. Why did the upgrade yeah. explode? Because it's... From shrapnel. He's wearing armor. Line watcher. His watcher. armor has abs. He's smarter than Tony Stark. Smarter than the average bear. I'm smarter than the average bear. He's smarter than a fifth grader, though. Jeez, you agree. But before I find Ivy. Hey, but whoa, I smell so well. Fuck! Ooh, wait a minute. Wow. Did you... That's kind of sad. Why did you uh, move that? I don't know why. Um, trying to get this uh, Riddler trophy. There we go. I'm trying. There we go. Ooh. I got fuck those things so hard. Yeah. Speaking of Bruce Wayne's dead parents. Um, <laughs> okay, fucking segue. I thought I could do best. this. I'm the best. Dead. No, I can't. I'm the best. I'm the best at segways. Don't worry. Okay, Damn. so I was rewatching Brave and the Bold with one of my buds, and they actually Shout do a, a portrayal of the Batman death scene, but give context that Batman as a kid. He was a spoiled brat. And yeah, he was rich. Of course he was spoiled. Why don't they show any of that? In other media, at least. Daddy, I want the big pony. Alright, Bruce. And you have two <laughs> big ponies at home. I want another one. Yeah, they're going to Brazil. Man, man <laughs> every time they see, like, kid, um... And Bruce, it's always this idealized American rich family, like, Papa, you got me this nice new action figure. Oh, thank you. You did good on your grade, son. Like, that kind of shit. I think Batman was like that one fucking asshole kid from the Harry Potter movies. Pretty much. Until his parents died. Dudley. The one that turned into a blueberry? Wait, no, that's not. That's, that's Charlie in the Chocolate that's Factory. <laughs> I mean, I mean, Harry Pot I mean, Harry Potter made like his aunt or like that blonde bitch boy Ralph. I'm talking about someone else. Um, Draco. Draco Malfoy. Frank Zappa. Uh, Potter, you're a. F I can't say that on this channel. You're a fucker. Okay. Yeah, oh, by sure, the way, we. Oh, by the way, we found poison ivy. Oh, Jesus Christ. See what was wifey about to rape him with tentacles? I've seen enough hentai to know where this is going. Uh -huh. Not really. Joke. Not really. There's, a plant. There's a plant. There's a plant. There's plants, plants everywhere. But, <laughs> but Ivy, the nearest weed dispensary is back in Gotham. Not that kind of plant, you idiot. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay, Batman. I can make weed from my fingertips. <laughs> Nightwing, <laughs> go get us some Kush. Meet me on Arkham Island. Is your hair floating? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> um, either that or it's just really messy and sticky now. Ugh, messy and sticky. Ugh. Ugh. Steak game. Ugh. Ugh. You said sticky. It's so, so funny. <laughs> It's so funny, I died a little inside. Oh god, that was the only part of life I had left. Oh, you killed me. <laughs> okay, that's just me being an idiot. <laughs> See, this is why you shouldn't text and walk, kids. Don't text and walk, or else. Wait, is he coming at us? <laughs> that is so fun. He just stood there. Menacingly. Yeah, I still can't get it right. Wait, what did you do? I did. What, what, what was that supposed to be? 
Oh, your fucking Yoda attempt? Yes. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Yoda. I'll try in a second after I finish this fry. Yoda noise. Oh, we gotta go all the way back to the Arkham Mansion and proms tomorrow. And I have nothing to wear. Except this bat suit. I wish my cock was a rock, I must. Ah! I wish my cock was a cat woman. Ah! Jesus Christ. My Yoda attempt is kind of shit. Kind of shit. Eleventeen. Yeah, what if Yoda was Batman? Can't kill the Joker! What'd you say? Pretty He'd be pretty, pretty short. He'd be pretty short. Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure, sure he to... could kill the Joker if he needed to. He was probably gonna kill Palpatine had he been successful. And Dooku. Have standards on this. Kill Dooku, I will. For the lols. He's gonna use the force on Joker. Not nah, pussy like. <laughs> <laughs> Batman, I got you! <laughs> you just. First choke you, I will. <laughs> Yeah. He's just, hey, hey, Batman. He, he just it kills him instantly. Everyone hey, just Batman. saved Barbara would still have a spine if you would actually have a spine. <laughs> Kill you, I will. Not Barbie. Not, Not Lenny! <laughs> you can brush my hair. Hey, you sure can because she can't do it herself anymore. Yeah, still, she can't use her leg, she can still brush her own hair. The I mean, that's true. Nice and plastic. It wasn't a good one. Thick. You can brush my face. <laughs> Take it any place. <laughs> Take me anywhere. Imagination. A party. party. Except Brazil. <laughs> Don't take me to Brazil. You're going to Brazil. <laughs> Come on, Barbie. Let's go party. <laughs> okay, Come on, Barbie. Come on, Bar Come on, Barbie. Let's go to Brazil. No, please. <laughs> Enthralling gameplay. To work and plushies. Enthralling. Riveting. I was kind of. Oh, damn it. I was so close to pulling him into the electrified water. <laughs> oh, that never gets old. No, no killing. <laughs> I don't want to be. Can't, Barbie. This is me, Ken. You will become marketable plushie by my hand. All Everyone right. Is a marketable plushie. <laughs> Several, probably. I Batman. have a good one, actually. You have uh, a Batman plush? Ah, crazy frog! I have, I have two, and also a Joker plush. You you should make them kiss and record it and put it on Twitter. I'm gonna make Harley watch. <laughs> Get cut. <laughs> Get Because I also have a Harley plush. Mr. J! Uh, get <laughs> no! Uh, get cut, bitch. Mr. J, no! <laughs> I'm gonna make Batman and Joker kiss and make Harley watch. Oh my god. Alright, so we should ask. She's into it, and this was her fan fiction the whole time. Um, nom, nom. We should get uh, Minty. Um, nom, we should get Minty to record <laughs> some fucking uh, Harley line. Put that over the video. Oh nah, if you if you film that before um, this part goes up, I'll place it right here. Look at look at Batman and Joker cucking Harley. Look at it. Look at it. I'm gonna I'm gonna make the shortest video and just send it to you when you're done. <laughs> it'll be it'll be two seconds long. You'll be you'll be fisting those two together and it'll pan over to Harley and zoom in real fast. It's just gonna be really fucking aggressive for like two seconds and it's done. <laughs> you're welcome. Less work for you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I need to find a funny video. I need to do a funny video and like have it put into these videos. 
Not the fucking twerking video. Fuck that. <laughs> what are you talking about? That's my favorite brass video of all time. It, no, it made not. those. It made those parts of Honey Pop. It's okay. His balls are clapping. <laughs> you can't see that though. And so is my What's diabetes. The point? Oh, we're not. We're not at a McDonald's or Jack in the Box. <laughs> Sir, this is a Wendy's. Sir, this is oh, a fuck Wendy's. My drive. Bad. <laughs> so let me tell you about the DMC Lord. This is a Wendy's, sir. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. But let me but let me tell you about that. Well, let me tell you about Dante's massive wing there. Dante is virgin. Donkey may wonky. How to make actual heroes. Make them badasses, have them indestructible, and not know what sex is. Make them retarded. That's the best way to do it. Vir Virgil had the sex once, but he hated it because it weakened him. Not my mind. Much. <laughs> and and it gave him a worthless deadbeat son. Dead weight. He's not deadbeat. He's a deadbeat. Dead weight. That's what that's what I meant to say. Dead weight. Let me see. Correct yourself faster. Virgil's a dead weight. He just oh, takes child support for all of your your neurons are alive. <laughs> Dead beat. Don't worry, don't worry about it. This Are we seriously like... having an argument about this right now? I was gonna say, I like how we're talking about DMC know. during a fucking Batman Let's See, Play. See, the joke is to discourage that. <laughs> yeah, but that's what these Let's Plays are more successful when you talk about shit. Are they? <laughs> no, I mean, I'm just kidding, but, you know. It just looks like you're eating them. That's why I keep going, mmm, mmm, because you eat he just looks so damn tasty. Commenters, if you like it when Bergie does that, leave a comment. If you don't, message leave me on Twitter. <laughs> leave a comment. <laughs> oh. I like him when he does that. Thank you, baby. I like it. I like it when you give me the look. So. <laughs> anyway, Where, where's the Joker? <laughs> where's Batman? I want to suck him off. Where's Batman? I've heard my mic a little too hard. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe don't do that. No, it's fun. I like it. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> this dumbass brought a flower into a room where he's talking to Pamela Isley, a plant manipulator. I manipulate these plants to make them do my bidding. I'm so bring, I'm bring, I'm bring, I'm bring some roses. So what's that about Arkham Asylum being a revolving door facility? <laughs> Facility. Fucking revolving door. That's what fucking Arkham Asylum is. Uh. Oh no, I have been defeated. <laughs> Thanks, Jim. See you of in a week. Of course, I love you. Dirty hoe. So did Ivy just basically entranced that fucking dude. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. What a fucking simp. She's she... Of course I love you. <laughs> but to be fair, uh, at least the guy has an excuse, as in Pamela Isley actually has hypnotizing superpowers. Y'all who are sipping for randos on Twitter, you don't have that excuse. <laughs> yeah, imagine. Hmm. No, I mean. unless you've dropped seven hundred dollars. No, like All right. At... All right. no, 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 no. I wasn't gonna give press shit for that. <laughs> no, because. Yeah, but... Fucking Briggy is. They brought the animal before me. <laughs> oh yeah, we haven't talked about the spirit of Ark and things for a while. Story's getting weird. What's happening in that story? Um, gotcha. this is the spirit of Amadeus Arkham, and he talks about his fucking life and how he's miserable, and he decided to fund, found this I'm Arkham still Asylum. still an old man. I'm still very old. <laughs> Amadeus, isn't that that... Five-part Pokemon from Yu-Gi-Oh. Wait, no. That's no, the that's the famous composer. Oh, I hate everything about what you just said. I mean, it's like uh, Pokemon. I meant to say, what the hell are they called in Yu-Gi-Oh? And then there's Exodia pieces. And then there's Doctor Zayus. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean the actual monster. What are they called? Monsters. Is that it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, there's that Groot. No, wait. <laughs> Is Groot? that Groot? <laughs> that's Groot. That's Groot with fucking leprosy. No, so, 
So Joker uh, infected Ivy with some Titan formula, and her plants are going berserk. Damn. I hate, hate these flowers. They make traveling such a pain in the ass. Fuck it, fruit. The <laughs> um, Oh, group. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> I am group. Playing an arts and crafts game with Groot. Damn it, you can't blow it up. <laughs> well, what can you do? You can't do shit to it. Seriously, I hate these fucking things. Because of that! God, it's so fucking annoying. Especially if you don't see one that's off screen, but it sees you, because of course it sees you. It just fucking strikes you out of nowhere, and you're just like, Huh! Who <laughs> guess I wasn't supposed to have fun today! <laughs> yes! Yes. Calm down, buddy. It's just a video game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he reminds me of you when you got mad at a bitch in your dream and then you took it into real life. Oh, wait. I forget what the fuck that even was. Someone someone stole your car. Oh, that's right. <laughs> but it was just a dream. I kept calling that bitch a cunt in my dream like, You fucking cunt, get out of my car. <laughs> get your cock out of my Chrysler, you son of a bitch. She fuck it. This fucking bitch got into my car, and I, I think I think I kept saying get out of my car, and she just looked at me and said no. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think I think you said she drove off and you woke up. Uh, yeah, I was I was I ran outside to check if my car was there, and I was like, oh thank God, this fucking bitch. But but you, you put that, you put that anger into the call that day. That's true. Well, that, that dream isn't as weird as the one I had like a few nights ago with fucking Jimmy Neutron characters. Because you couldn't handle the Neutron, so... Might as well tell it, so basically... I had a dream where... Blacks and whites you know, could the... mingle peacefully and not have to fear racial diversity. Yes, that's exactly what it was. No, um... You know the fucking floating tire thing that Jimmy has in the Jimmy Neutron show? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So basically me and a bunch of Jimmy Neutron characters were like in that and we drove to a house that was next to a cemetery and we did a B and E. We we broke in and, and we broke in and entered and uh, we were gonna steal some shit. We looked around and said, hmm, this looks nice. This looks nice to take. And uh one of one of them, Sheen, I guess, and he said Hey, they're coming. <laughs> they're coming, Jimmy. I ain't going back to jail, Jimmy. Hey, Brett, they're coming. So we re ran, and uh, they got into the fucking tire thing and flew off, and the person grabbed me, and I managed to escape and run away. And they and the pe and the and the Jimmy Neutron characters came back to me. And the flying tire, and we flew away. And the and the and the people were shaking their fist at me. Then we flew back down, and this 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 baffles me. I don't know why I said this. It's I woke up and I was like, that made no sense what I said. I said, hey, we had every intention to rob this place, but we didn't find anything of value, so we just decided to leave. And they accept and they and they accepted that as an apology. I like the thought that Carl Weezer is like. Up to fucking burgle houses that just. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jim, we're gonna, this is a. I got some jewels in there, and uh, we're gonna, we're gonna kill him. <laughs> All clear, Jim. She's All clear, like, Jim. They're coming. They're coming, Jimmy. Hey, Jimmy, they're coming. Also, I'm a rat from the barnyard. Oh, oh, that's right. I remember that character. He he was simping over a cow. Damn, that mouth movement though. Yeah, Cash is the weirdest model in this game. Very square jaw. His 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 lips look like a fucking bat symbol trying to talk. Whoa. So wait, we literally just got to the fucking mansion. To go somewhere else. Oh, for fuck's sake. Padding, padding, padding. 
I hate it when levels do that. Like, hey, go to this place. You talk to someone. Hey, go halfway to the city. So we can go back to your place. So we can go back to my place. Batman, don't you have cash on speed dial? <laughs> no. Clearly. Yeah, it's called a credit card. Imagine if hey, Batman. Hey, baby, why don't you come over to your come over to your my place? Hey, babe, so are we you... can go to your place. <laughs> hey, babe, are you an angel? Because I'm allergic to feathers. Feathers. <laughs> How would you guys feel if <laughs> Bat if Sheen was Batman? I'd hate it. Well, I mean, Sheen took the red pill, so how good of a Batman he is, I don't know. I don't understand that red pill, red pill, blue pill thing. I don't either, but it's the only place thing, man. I thought, I thought, I, I thought you had my back. I understand, I, Tyler. I understand. I just you, you failed what? me. You failed me, Tyler. There. So, um, earlier, uh, maybe a couple parts ago. I picked up a map of all the Riddler trophy locations. Are you okay, Natalie? Oh god. Are you okay, Natalie? I had a bit of ass Yeah, I when I burped I had a bit of acid reflux, but I'm okay. Huh, seems to be a running theme today, unfortunately. I had some water. Agua. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I had you're some right. agua. I'm help. fine now. You were right, Natty, the water did help, so thank you for that. Agua. Ugh. I'm glad you feel better too. Yes. It's not fun, is it, Matt? <laughs> I still have water. I beat these people up. Ow! <laughs> With how they're dressed, I. I swear to God, oh. masters in this game. No. <gasps> um. Oh, wait, that's just me. What the fuck? What? Yeah, what the fuck was that? What is this part turning into? What? Um, what? Did someone say something? Yeah, you went like, oh! I thought a bug was crawling on me, but that was just my, <laughs> my leg hair. I see. I'm okay. I spooked myself. Hey. Uh, monster. <laughs> 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 Okay, so right. this challenge. I really dropped my fucking plate. <laughs> oh. It sounded like me when okay. I actually dropped my I'm plate okay. and made that cracking sound and it scared me. It's, it's alright. So, uh, this section of the game, what you're supposed to do, you're supposed to grapple up to one of the watchtowers and use your line launcher after you incapacitate the sniper um, to uh, enter the building and take him out. It took me a while to figure that out. Thankfully, I cut past that. Excellent. Is this the cut? It's gonna take a, just a little bit. Oh, okay. It's gonna take a little bit for me to cut. I didn't leave too much in. Maybe I did. It's been a while since I've seen these parts. Gee. Wonder if this is gonna work. Nope. Oh, speaking of... Let me just walk on the fucking roof here. <laughs> Speaking of Sportsmaster, like, were we talking about Sportsmaster? I said earlier that those villains look like they could be henchmen to Sportsmaster. I see. You ready to go fight some crime? I have... Let's go fight some crime. What do you say? <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's me cutting. All right. <laughs> okay. Oh no. Okay. Okay, is Super it me, or does DC just kind of have some things that are just... Let's throw darts at a board, see what we get. Like, Sportsmaster is probably the prime suspect. I mean, yeah. I think that's true of any, like, large comic book universe. Especially if other properties have been acquired over the years, like DC and Marvel. Uh, you're gonna have a ton of villains running around that you can just randomly find on a dartboard to kind of like randomly insert into stories in case you ran out of ideas that week. It's less likely with Marvel though. It's, it feels like it's more of a thing with DC.
I thought I said Adam West, but you know. Adam We. Adam Weast. I thought you said yeast. I thought you said yeast. What am you I doing? Mr. Patrick. You're fired. Oh god, a compass for you. You're fired again. Dick punch. <gasps> Dick oh. punch. <laughs> ah. Oh no. They can't reproduce. Good, they really shouldn't. <laughs> What if they got their lives together after rehab in, in jail and they wanted to start a family? You're they're, doing that. They're in straight jackets. This is the Fucking who cares? Mm -hmm. and they're also going, ah! Berg, I will lay this down right now. These are DC characters. That's not going to last long. I'm just imagining them just being normal and just like wanting a family, but no, no, wait. Bad men punch my dick. <laughs> Damn. Rehab is over. We we would have kids, but uh, Batman turned one of my testicles in a fucking casket on it, so you know can't really do that anymore. It's okay. We can adopt. I'm just saying, yeah, you can adopt. Adopt the baby. <laughs> Give the orphans the home that Batman never had. Harsh. <laughs> give, give them an Alfred. Give them an Alfred. <laughs> They're like uh, tiny little the Alfred. Tiny little Alfred. They're like tiny little Alfreds. <laughs> the Roombas. <laughs> really? Roombas? <laughs> What Jared, if you, what, what if you saw Roombas in this game? <laughs> I, yeah. I, don't, I, don't, I don't have any cash. Um, if I saw Roomba in this game, um, it, would, it would elevate an already 10 out of 10 to an 11. Fuck! <laughs> out of 10. Seriously, I hate that shit. This, like, the, the worst. <laughs> Dumb Batman villains. I think we all can agree that the best Batman villain is Captain Clown. What about Captain Crunch? Every time you say Captain Clown, I keep fucking thinking you're gonna say Captain Crunch. <laughs> yeah, that's what I just said. It's been the running gag. Who the fuck is Captain Clown again? He was a <laughs> villain in the animated series, just like a little robot lackey that Joker had. And Batman puts him through like a metal shredder, because he's a robot. And Joker's just like, you killed Captain Clown! You killed Captain Clown! And you then killed yeah. my son! Okay, there's Calendar Man and Kite Man. I thought Kite Man was a great Man, animal. fuck you. I'll see you at work. Oh, yeah, I I'm cut again. Me because I look good in oh. green. Maybe if you get rid of that yee yee ass haircut, you'd have a henchwoman like Harley. No, better yet, maybe Catwoman will call your dog ass if you weren't such a creep with that Fifty Shades of Green crap. Nigma. <laughs> Did you say Nigma? Nigma, yep. Nigma. <laughs> I thought he was going to say the actual N word. Nope. I feel like Joker would say that. <laughs> <sighs> no, he's crazy. But he's not that crazy. Yeah, I mean, there was a Captain America crossover where he where he was like working with um, Red Skull, and then when he realizes that Red Skull's a Nazi, he throws a shift and he's like, "I'm an, I'm a psychopath, but I'm an American psychopath. I may be a lunatic, but I'm an American lunatic." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> boys. I, the Joker's going to cure racism. <laughs> I may be crazy, but I'm not a racist. Oh, yeah. Does anyone remember Kite Man? He's in the Harley Quinn uh, animated yeah. show, and he's amazing. 
Yeah. He's also he's also in I Hate Everything. Oh, that's right. I have evil kite powers. <laughs> evil kite I can, powers. I can. I cut, have evil kite powers. I can cut your I kites from the sky and make children cry. Ha 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 ha. And what was Calendar Man's whole thing? Calendar Man. He, okay. He so sorry. Um, what nope. were you gonna say? Go ahead. Oh, okay. I was gonna make a uh, sorry. <laughs> I was going to make a stupid joke. It's okay. Um, so, uh, Calendar Man used to be kind of a nobody. And then there was a story arc, a story arc written in the 80s called uh, Batman the Long Halloween. Uh, basically, Calendar Man's whole shtick is that he'll commit murders or crimes on certain holidays. Now, you might think that as, like, as a concept, it's kind of weak. But a lot of good writers make uh, tend to make it work. Uh, he also plays a big, uh, semi-big role in the Arkham series, starting with City, but we'll get to that when we get to that. So basically, he's a holiday-related killer. Oh. I imagine it becomes a little harder, dependent on the holiday. Like, starts killing on Easter or Hanukkah. What are you going to do with, <laughs> do with Hanukkah? <laughs> the Hanukkah murder? <laughs> he's going to take a dreidel and fucking stab it in someone's eye. No, he's gonna spin it into the eye. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I forget. I don't know. I don't know Jewish holidays, <laughs> so I thought the dreidel was the thing with the candles. You know, the wooden Beyblades. No, no, the dreidel is the thing you spin onto the ground. It's a oh, little yeah. game you play while you celebrate Hanukkah. Oh. Was it? Was the thing that puts the candles? Is that just a candelabra? Yeah. Yep. Take a yeah, candelabra just... and stick it in their eyes and make them bleed. Oh, here's a gimmick. Yeah, here's a gimmick. They put explosive things on the gargoyles. Which, as you can tell, I'm also a fan of. <sighs> nope. God. That dude is dead. Very dead. Why would, you just, why would they destroy perfectly nice looking gargoyles? I would have put those in my home. <laughs> put them in my home. Okay. <laughs> I'd put them around my house and keep demons away from my place. <laughs> yes, demons. Yeah, that's what they were used for. Mm. The, the scared, the scared the evil spirits away. Oh yeah, at least that's what they were. Interns, I think. What? Demons. Jared, don't do it. <laughs> no. Well, Are you, you silly bitch. <laughs> um, I'm Batman. <laughs> that's kind of trust of you, Jared. <laughs> Pretty Yeah, I should really stop using the cargoyles. <laughs> God, I'm being Jared, a fucking no. idiot. <laughs> such, I'm such an idiot. Jared, stop. Jared, stop. <laughs> Jared, put down that gun. Jared, you're, Jared, you're ruining this family. Jared Dimidome. <laughs> Lady Dimidome. <laughs> <laughs> my, 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 fa my favorite villain from the Resident Evil 8 game is Lady Dimidome. Ruining this family, Jared. I'd let that. I'd let that. I think we should spend some time apart. Those gargoyles were my fathers. I would oh let that. God. I would let that vampire bitch put her fat ass on my face. Oh my god. But I, th I think that's a missile that she's preparing to load into the missile launcher, but it's a butt plug. Damn. Oh! Oh shit! This is like the word from word animated series thing. This is basically, this is from Mad Love, uh, the animated version of Mad Love, where she's first, uh, as Harleen Quinzel, she's, uh, in her first day at the asylum. And she's getting a briefing from one of the doctors about, like, these are hardcore psychotics. They'll, they'll tear you apart if you let them. I see. And and she's like, uh, I'll be fine. And then they she sees the... They want to miss... <laughs> and then she, she's, she sees the Joker. Oh. What? How the fuck did that... I'm uh, not complaining. <laughs> oh my lord. Shitty AI. That could have gone like thirteen flavors of wrong, as could that have. <laughs> oh, it's okay, cause you're Batman. It's okay, you're Batman. It's fine. Stop shooting me! No. 
I am. Damn, it's almost like they have a problem with you. Wow. Up their friends. Those crooks sound suspiciously like Tyler and Eric. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely not around. <laughs> I know, they sound like some smart sons of bitches. Well, one of them does. Yeah, you're right. One Tyler. <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna be that guy. He's, a, he's average intelligence. I went to Just college. Like Tomater. <laughs> Just like Tomater. <laughs> Just like Tomater. <laughs> well, he does say uh, Tomater, average intelligence. But without the tub. Do you remember you were there? <laughs> Shoot, you ought to remember you was there too. Fuck. <laughs> There's a fucking Tomator flashlight. Dick punch. Available. Why? <laughs> Why are you talking about this? Because it's relevant. Because <laughs> None of us wanted to be either reminded or learned about that. Well, guess what, fucko? <laughs> fucko is my no, clown name, by the way. Would you just be technically fucking Larry the Cable Guy's soft pork? No, it's his mouth. <laughs> you know, for, joke, for Joker's next henchman, I want somebody named Fucko the Clown. Fucko, fucko the Clown. Okay. But, yeah. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> I, I can't smell what the rock is cooking. Oh. <laughs> I don't get it. I can't Dwayne. smell what the rock is cooking. Dwayne the Rick Johnson. <laughs> Dwayne the Rick Johnson. Okay, so, Jared, there's a comic... Do you know about the infamous Zootopia abortion comic? No, no, no. You... Just, just tell, just tell them about the rock. <clears throat> You'll get that part better. Yeah, fuck the Zootopia comic. I know of oh that God. comic. Yes. There's you a... know of the rock. Yes. Yeah, I know about Dwayne. I can't save a movie for my life, Johnson. Pacifier. <laughs> He was in the pacifier. I've never seen that movie, so that argument is invalid oh, that to me. Him. That's right. Never mind. That was Vin Diesel. What is it? What was it? Hey, hold on. I got. Can't... I got. Give me a second. Wait, uh... wait, wait, wait. Dwayne the Rock Johnson is also a wrestler. You know about that, yeah? Yep. Well, one of his famous uh, sayings is, "Can you smell what the Rock is cooking?" Mm-hmm. So you know that meme. So you just being put together with the Zootopia is like I I can't smell what the rock is cooking. And Nick Wilde looks shocked and appalled. Oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> yep. I can't smell what the rock is cooking. I I've never read that whole thing, and I don't plan on doing that in the future. I've just seen like screenshots. I've seen the memes it's... where she just slaps him instead, and it's just kind of funny. We can it's we after this. Boys. After this, you can. Sh yeah, Eric, you could show him the fucking video that you showed us, or was that Nat? I forget. Uh, that was uh, me. Uh, 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 oh, uh, oh, uh, what the, uh, what the fuck? Uh, well, just, please tell me this uh, is part of the game. I would hope so. Ooh. That's a oh, face. That's cute. How would I, you feel I, if this I, is I your I feel first... violated. What do you mean? Why? Because of the glitch thing. What if this actually happened? It, it did happen. What if um, this is your first time playing, you and you were scared that your game was fun? Joker. Uh, oh God. What the fuck? Is he arriving? Batman's back. Batman's driving. I am Batman now. Is this is this the DLC? Are you walking as Joker? Yep. Indeed I am! Are you the one playing, Eric? Wait. Jared, Jared. Is, silent. Jared is so silent right uh, now. Oh, Why do you sound like Smeagol? Lord of the Rings. 
spaghetti, 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 spaghetti. Man, this this recording went down the drain. God, that mouth. That mouth is going. <laughs> Did Jared die? Why is he dead? He's all yours, Joker. He's yours. Jared. Gerard. Why aren't you saying anything? He's leaving the commentary to. <laughs> oh hey, uh, sorry guys, it just glitched out there. What I miss? Uh, you know, it, like it crashed for a minute. I was worried, but then the game came back on. It's great. Uh, I was, oh, you were doing. I was doing a bit. <laughs> I was about to say, oh, you were doing a bit. I was doing a bit. <laughs> okay. Bruce, wait a minute. Bruce you Wayne's know. dead, but you're Bruce Wayne. Wait, what the fuck's going on? I mean. <laughs> wait. Okay, well, credit where creds do. I admire the dedication to the bit. I'm a little baby. See, I would have, I, I would have dropped from the call, but like doing that would have <laughs> fucking fucked up your video. Fucked yeah. up the video really bad. So. You made me warm my mic again. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Is that a rat? Yep. Oh shit. A rat. I had I I had no idea fucking Batman knew psychic pebbles. Cool. Okay, so this is the last scarecrow section. Damn. After this, does he die? I hope so. Damn, I hope fucking Joker no not Joker. Scarecrow fucking killed himself. Do you think Bambi dies in this midquel? No. In this what? Midquel? Oh yeah, that's what we called that. We, that's what we called Bambi Two. Oh, oh, like, I, he cut out. I swear to God, I thought he said like midquel or something. What? No. Fucking <laughs> midquels. We for we forgot Bambi was a is a bit of a narcissist in him and his children. Bambi <laughs> two and Bambi one and a half. <laughs> what does his voice sound what does his voice sound like the whiny little bitch? Well it's Joker with a puppet. <laughs> Oh. Needle man. No wait. Needle man. What is his name again? Scarecrow. <laughs> Evil man. No needle man. Needle man. Needle man. Because <laughs> his fingers. <laughs> I noticed. Okay. Oh, okay. No, it's okay, Ned. You're thinking of the DC character, the ultimate underrated character, Evil Man. What is he doing? Evil Man. Oh, I don't know if I brought this up, but looking at his needle hand, um, in Injustice Two, Scarecrow was voiced by Robert England. Stay Bullshit. Toto. Oh no. I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. But where are we, Toto? Where are we? Where the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> that was such bullshit. Was that, <laughs> was that fucking uh, Batman and Wizard of Oz? Yes. Where are we, Toto? We're not in Canada. We're not in Gotham anymore. Got my message. <laughs> We're not in Canada anymore. I almost took Kansas, but it's trans. I uh, yeah. Sure, let's go, let's go, yeah. I'm not in I wish I was in Canada. I mean, I know Deadpool and Wolverine are. Oh, um, what, what I was saying beforehand. 
uh, Scarecrow is voiced by Robert England in Injustice 2. You might also know him as Freddy Krueger. No way. Hey. Yep, look it up. That's, That's pretty cool. Awesome. That's actually perfect casting. It is literally perfect casting. Alright, here's bullshit number two. What you're supposed to do is grapple up to this elevator and climb up. And my controller refuses to let me up. Uh, we are rapidly punching it. You kill Captain Clown. You kill Captain Clown. You killed, <laughs> you killed Captain Crunch. How dare you? He's gonna say Captain Crunch. <laughs> Jared should have dumped over it and said, "You killed Captain Crunch." Ow. <laughs> and that's why I didn't dub over it. <laughs> No, I dropped okay. my phone on my dick. Not your pee -pee. I'm sorry, I hurt my penis. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I know I don't. I know I do this all the time, but it's unintentional. You, 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 you gotta, gotta protect it. I will protect it for you, woman. It's like the equivalent of them flirting in my Twitter posts. No, we, we 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 say we say more we say more shit than that. Wait, he saved you. Why isn't he just correcting you now? Because hey, what's um, the, toy? the power of other game section. Right. Yeah, because games got a game. Because he watched the toy with him. <sighs> power of person kills you. Ooh! Oh no, it's a big skeleton! It's a, it's Andre the Giant Skeleton. Hey Matt, it's just like the skeletons from Army of Darkness. <laughs> I'm just imagining... Fucking... And he killed himself. <laughs> he, he couldn't handle it. I can't he's handle so the world where I have to fight Batman! Oh hey, he's back. <laughs> Uh -huh. Angry duding. Angry duding. Angry duding. <laughs> I really loved Andre and uh, Princess Bride. It's a good movie. Yeah. I've never seen it. Yet. I mean, I had no idea that movie was the origins of Angry Duding. <laughs> what? Yes. You know the gif of a skeleton playing a bone flute and it says angry duding? Yeah. Let me let me put it in the thing real quick. This is angry duding. Bergy, look at the chat. Alright. That was our last Scarecrow mm -hmm. section. Of the whole game? Yes. Are there be more? Nope. Uh, trilogy. Scarecrow. Trilogy of Scarecrow. And don't worry, if you want more Scarecrow, Arkham Knight will be your jam and jelly. Cool. Uh, oh, that's right. I don't remember. He's a... Barely big antagonist in that one. <laughs> Batman, look at my nutsack! Gross. That's As gross. Berg, you see the gif? Hang on, Nettie. What are you saying, Nettie? She said, look at the thing in chat. The, the chat. You need, you need yeah. Berg, you need your ears checked, dude. You open your ear. Uh, you I tell him that you so many to, times. You need to open your ears, man. You need to open them wider. You need to get fucking Jack and Dexter ears. So elf ears? Yeah, essentially, but bigger than elf ears because Jack and Dexter ears are like comically longer. 
Why is Scarecrow going at it? Who cares? I locked the door behind you. He ain't coming out again. I can hear some small music. I thought that was part of the game, <laughs> to be honest. I thought so, I thought so too. What the For hell a split was that? second, it's like, I don't remember hearing this when I played. What the hell, what the hell is that? Um, that was me. What, what, what why was that, what happened? <laughs> okay, something happened with my phone, but I'm, I'm okay. Okay, did someone try calling? Someone try calling you. It, it wasn't me, I promise. I mean, no one accused you. Not yet. Oh, what the shit? Oh, I'm happy. How come in the other games you don't get all the stuff right off the bat? You have to get it over time. Those games got a game. Actually, in the um, in the Arkham series, especially City and Night, you have a good majority of your power ups from the previous games um, at the start. Ah, uh, which I was is not made aware of that. Yeah, which is, I think that's really fucking awesome. <laughs> I guess. Some of the Ratchet and Clank games that too, they give you some of their some of the shit like in the beginning. Yeah, I mean, what I like about the Arkham game is like, yeah, you, you have some of your old shit and you have some new shit to play with. Yes. The only place where it kind of doesn't make sense is Origins, and we'll get to that when we get to that. Ugh, I see. I'm kind of getting thirsty for some water. I have Mountain Dew, but I don't want to drink any of this. I've already drank two cans today of Game of Juice. And we ain't even playing the game right now. We're just commentating. I just need water. I'll get that after water. recording. I'm... What? How, how many minutes are we into this, actually? We are 57 minutes in. We have 26 minutes left. Oh, boy. How would you feel if I stepped away for, like, a minute to get water? I wouldn't be offended. Okay. I'm gonna do that real fast, cause yeah, my stomach and body is craving water. That's all right. BRB, everyone, BRB gamer. <laughs> so this is the penultimate part of Batman: Arkham Asylum. Uh, we have one more part after this. Um. Ooh, that's meat. <laughs> yep, it's meat for Killer Croc. Who we're trying to. F Not... What? Sorry, Eric? Oh, sorry. I was gonna say, no, it's obviously hinting at their DC's eventual crossover with Mortal Kombat. You remember the Mortal Kombat character Meat? Huh. Yeah, I'm saying there was actually a Mortal Kombat character that's just a pile of flesh. I think he's from Ar Armageddon. Yep, I know who you're talking about. And technically he started in Mortal Kombat 4. Did he? Yeah, he was an unlockable. Okay. Um, and then there was Mortal Kombat versus DCU. Oh, yeah. Which is where Richard Epcar first played the Joker. Um, he plays Joker in a lot of the Netherrealm stuff. He's not a bad Joker. Danger. 
Yep. So I guess I should probably mention why we're going down here. We have to synthesize an antidote for the Titan formula. And to do so, we need a specific plant type to synthesize a cure from. And naturally, where that is, is one of the most dangerous fucking places on the asylum grounds is Killer Croc's lair. Because of... I want Batman just to get sick of Scarecrow's garbage and just punch him. I want his sack. <laughs> uh, I returned from getting water. Welcome back, Brass. Ah, uh, yes, thank you. What what happened? I saw a fucking big thing. So I was explaining why we're down here is because we need to get an antidote for the Titan formula, yada yada yada. It's in Killer Croc's lair, the most dangerous place in the asylum, and we just watched Scarecrow get fucking demolished by Killer Croc. Damn. So guess where we're heading next? <laughs> that big lizard, I mean alligator man. Yep. We're going to his lair. <laughs> so dumb. Later. Did you just fucking die? Yep. Yep. I thought Batman can't One swim. Fact, Batman can't swim, apparently. I don't know. Damn. I thought Batman knew everything. I could have sworn there were some Ninja Turtles down here. That happens later. <laughs> In as in Justice 2 DLC. And also a movie. Oh, that's right. That was a weird crossover. Dude, I can be gaming. That was a big roar. Batman, can you hear me? Have you found Cross Lair yet? No, Barbara. Jared's being dumb and going on a two second detour. Jared's being himself. Old sewer. Huh. When do I realize what? that I don't need to be here? What the fuck right is now. happening with... <laughs> what is happening with your fuck... Why is he glitching like a motherfucker? Oh my god, what is wrong with your face? Your graphics card is on is fire happening? right now. Oh my god. I don't know what you guys are talking about. It's running fine for me. It's, the screen's spazzing out, dude. Yeah, I'm having it's a on, fucking stroke. Because it's on insanely low quality. Because I typically don't like to waste too much effort on these raws. He's dancing. I see. He's doing the spaz dance. He's doing the stanky leg. Do the stanky leg leg. Okay, this is probably the one of the most iconic sections in this game, the sewers, or Croc's Lair. We have to be extremely careful on these platforms to not make too much noise, otherwise we could attract the attention of Killer Croc. Don't worry, you're going to attract his attention anyway. And basically, every time he pops out of the water, you have to use a battering on him to activate his shock collar. Damn. Bruh, I'm going at like two frames a second right now. I think we all are. Mm. It's like a horror game. Oh. Where you survive. A survival horror game, if you will. People are literally shooting off fireworks right now. I just want to, for the record. I, I think I just heard one go off. Yep. I Great. You need oh, open your window and say, "Can you shut the fuck up? I'm trying to record a let's play." My windows are already open. <laughs> oh, well, go yell right now. Can you shut the fuck up? Uh, just scream. <laughs> there like you go. <laughs> mission, mission accomplished. Why is it so hot in here? Cause it's Florida. Oh yeah. Maybe, don't you have your fan on? Oh fuck, it's that low, that's why. There you go. 
Uh, maybe starting next month, the temperature should be going up and I'll be able to put on my air conditioner. Oh my god. I was tempted to put my air conditioner in today, but my mom would have killed me because <laughs> she doesn't know when it's fucking hot. Ugh. <laughs> Isn't your body, like, prone to heating up? Yep. Damn. That's probably why. <laughs> yeah, so... Basically, huh. if you're having trouble with this section, just follow what I do here. Crouch and slowly walk. I mean, it's boring, but it, you know, it gives you the least shit. You said this section is iconic? Yeah, because, like, I remember this being promoted heavily in the marketing material, and this is probably one of the things people will remember from Arkham Asylum. Among many other things, mind you. Oh, there he is! And that's literally all you have to do. You batarang him and his shock color comes on. I want to see a, I want to see a mod of this where Killer Croc is Detective Cromwell. I was going to say, if you say Killer Bean, but that's worse. I'm coming for you, bad boy. Oh, no. Oh, God. I almost fucked up there so badly. Oh, the cool yeah, really, really close there. Like everything's having a seizure. Well, maybe... Jared, will you ever play Silent... No, go ahead. Will you ever play Silent Hill? Um... I don't know. I don't do good with horror. Uh, we'll save that for my Let's Play channel then. Yeah, so notice how I've been, like, not raising, like, the sound level really high and Killer Croc comes out anyway. Yeah, that's just a yeah. gimmick. I think it's back there, Jared. Turn around, turn left. There you go. Dumbass. Hey, hey Jared, would you play Dark Souls? Eric, will you play Devil May Cry 2? That was actually a legit question. Um, no. <laughs> doesn't, it, doesn't have to be any specific one. <laughs> not not at this time, no. But also, when are you playing Devil May Cry 2? Serious uh, question. <laughs> I will hang you myself. Go ahead. I, go to I, I told you I'll play it with you. Or at least be there with some more support. Oh no, he found me! Oh. Into the... river I go. It's like a big, easy target. <laughs> oh no, they can see me! <laughs> what if they made a mod where Killer Croc was small? <laughs> making, him, making him hard to hit. I found you, Batman! Oh no, he appeared behind me! That actually reminds me of the Tiny Toons episode where they parody Batman and they literally put a bullseye target on, what's it called? On Portly Pig. On Hampton? Hampton. <laughs> uh, Croc, I'm right there. Is he gonna do it? Because usually when he has a voice line, he pops out. <laughs> oh, there we go. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, no! I have fallen and I can't get out of the water. Why are you touching slime? Oh, that's the, uh... That's the plant we need a sample from to make an antidote for the Titan formula. See. Okay. Man, Jared, you always have an answer for everything. It's I pretty... don't know video games. <laughs> you have a you have a you have a gaming laptop, right? Yeah, but I only played one game. <laughs> and that's Fall Guys Fall Ultimate guys. Knockout. What about Minecraft? It's not on Steam. Oh. oh no, he can see me! Oh wow, I got him to pop up twice. There he is. Two Crocs. 
What if two crocs popped up? <laughs> two crocs Shakur. Two crocs, so it's a Are we there yet? Yeah, boy. We're no. moving very slowly. Wasn't that a movie as well? Are we there yet? I remember seeing that movie at least once and I completely forgot it. Yeah, you were, you were, you were watching it and then you were thinking, are we done yet? <laughs> Which movie? Are we there yet and are we done yet? Fucking Ice Cube plays as the dead. Yeah, I was gonna, does. I was gonna say Eddie Murphy, but okay. No, it's Ice Cube. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe a fucking Ice Cube played in a movie. That's cool. Science has come so far. He's, he is a director, and his son plays in the um, Straight Outta Compton movie. Who? If you were to tell me that wasn't a CG Ice Cube, I would have said you were crazy. His kid looks exactly like him. Wait, you're surprised that there was a song by Ice Cube in... No, if, uh... No, I'm surprised how much his kid looks like Oh, I, I misheard you. Yeah. Well, I'd, I would hope that he looks a little bit like him, because... I'm not talking a little bit. He looks like a clone in places. Oh my god, it's Django and Boba Fett. <laughs> yeah, it's actually a Jango and Boba Fett, Boba Fett situation. Well, I'd imagine it, like he would look like him because he's the result of his balls. <laughs> you know, when he's not wasting time fucking filming sh stuff with Conan and Kevin Hart. Well, I mean, I like Conan, so. I don't know why I said it so disgustingly. I'm just uh -huh. waiting for it. Actually, no, it's probably not gonna happen for the next Friday movie. Ugh. Oh, man. You know... What? <laughs> in hindsight, I probably should have cut a little bit of this out, but... But at least I think this is the last one. Just toss the electric thing in the water. No one will bring you. See, if this was Arkham City, we would use the freeze grenades. Nope, it's not the last one. The last one is somewhere else. I've got your screw, Batman. Who gave him that? Oh, I did. Damn you, Commissioner Cromwell. Cromwell is... Domwell. What? Oh, more fireworks making weird noises. I think I heard that. I can taste you already. Blah, 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 blah. What the fireworks or Cromwell? Actually, you know what? I'm surprised there hasn't what he was been. saying. Oh. I'm surprised there hasn't been a flash game. There was almost one. Ooh! I forgot who what was developed. Was... Sorry? What kind of game was it going to be? Uh, open world. Okay, fair enough. Open world action. I think it was developed by, oh god, this is gonna, uh, Pandemic Studios? <laughs> <laughs> um, I think they're now defunct, um, but... Thanks, EA. Probably. <laughs> I think EA bought them out and then fucking shot them in the back of the head. <sighs> there you are. Jesus. Ugh. I think months ago I tried seeing if Ugh. I could buy the X-Men Origins Wolverine game. Oh god. I'm yawning. I'm getting which tired. Is, which is better than the movie. Mm-hmm. Surprise. And there we go. 
Now we gotta get out of this place. <laughs> is that a bat explosive? Uh, it's a it's a sensor, a sonar thing. Oh. Uh. Oh no! Ow, my neck. It's, uh, oh, You're, well, I'll be here, babe. Why is your mom calling you now? <laughs> These let's plays are uh, they're pretty cool. Give me this channel, Matt. <laughs> Are you playing with your friends, Natalie? <laughs> what a funny story, Natalie. Why are you making her mom sound like fucking Tommy Doiseau? Because I can't imitate her mom. Oh, fair enough. I'm not very good at imitating Nat's mom. So I do Tommy Doiseau. I see. <laughs> okay, we're Jesus. almost we're almost done. No, I'm just tired because yeah. I'm fucking sleepy boy. And then after this, we'll have one more part to record. I know we're not doing that today, but you know. Yeah. Hey. Okay. I actually gotta sleep early because I gotta wake up early. But don't worry, we'll get to the uh, we'll get to the next game soon enough. Yes. Yeah. Um. I'm waiting for Arkham Knight. My boy is in there. Uh, you know, your boy ain't that great, Eric. <laughs> no, no. Jason? Yeah. Yeah. Jason is honestly my favorite. Jason kills people. I mean, oh, God. I, I think he does. I don't know. Yeah. He does. In Batman Under the Red Hood. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And there is also was... some... Sorry. That is basically his whole thing. He's a Batman that has the balls to kill. And I'm like, yeah, I'm for this. Because, yeah, his no-killing rule is dumb. Yes. There's also some DLC what? for Arkham Knight in which he kills people. But we'll get to that when we get to that. No spoilers. Yeah, we'll cross no. that first. Cool. Dear Lord. Oh, I'm coming. Oh, shit. Oh, oh no. The, br the bridge is destroyed. He broke the bridge, so he can't go back, even though by all accounts I don't really need to go back. Curse you, killer croc. Hey, 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 hey. Where is he? There he is. It's so cute. Fuck off, you big, ga you big gator man. <laughs> you fucking Gatorade. Gatorade. <laughs> you have Gatorades. <laughs> That's the real origin of Killer Croc. You drink too much back. Gatorade. Hi, Matt. <laughs> what, what, hey. what did your mother want? She wanted to check on me. Oh, how sweet. Uh, see, I thought it was because she wanted to join in on this Arkham Asylum playthrough. I don't fucking know this is happening. <laughs> Ima imagine you and Nat, you and your mom, Nat, doing fucking let's blues. My mom would just keep asking questions on what, what even everything is. Mom, this is a crafting table. It's used to craft stuff with. <laughs> no, it's just like, imagine if she joins us for Arkham City and we give her no context. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why? Or no. No. Her mom would be horrified by the shit that we say. Because uh, if my mom were to come in this shit, she. We would have to hold a lot back. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Yeah. yeah. This is my mother we're talking about. Believe it or not, on that last explosive gel thing, as a child, I did fuck that up <laughs> on occasion. As a child? Yeah, as like a, as a teenager. I was about to say, how old were you when this came out? Twelve. 
In your face! Thank you. <laughs> Finally, I was the one who didn't have to finish that joke. Later, Dan. I defeated Killer Croc. My friend thought it was funny that during the SpongeBob movie, I said that that big dude who stole their car. I was, I said his voice perfectly when he said the line out of the car, fellas. He laughed so hard at that. I don't know why. Out of the car, fellas. Jared, go that way. Okay, okay. We. Oui. <laughs> <laughs> Myself it's my kind, water of, kind of sounded like Joker teeth being crushed. Poor Joker, Joker teeth. teeth. What? Joker teeth. <laughs> he just instantly <laughs> fell over. He plates like a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> there was no impact. He just fell over. Yo, down I go. <laughs> I, oopsie, I slipped that up in there. there. Oop. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Uh, <laughs> God damn. Oh. He's oh, now good. Goldy Nut Buster! Spaghetti! Spooky spaghetti! Uh, I like spaghetti. Spaghetti's good, but. You know, what do you think about Spooky Spaghetti? I'm not, I would like to try. What do you think about our fruits? <laughs> you, you, you pick up I've the never been, I've never been to <laughs> You pick up a spaghetti, um, instead sort of spaghetti slice, you pick up a thing of spaghetti. <laughs> spaghetti slice. Spaghetti slice. <laughs> I was thinking of pizza. You pick up a sp you, pick, you pick up a thing of spaghetti, it goes, ooh. Mm. Have you ever been to spaghetti? Spaghetti is delicious. What was the question, Eric, and who were you asking? Brass, have you even been to a Whole Foods? No. I don't even think we have any in Florida. I, I could, I could be wrong. We have, we don't have Whole Foods. We have Publix. It's a fairly nice place. Some of the people I work with in my department, I can't stand. Mm. Some of them I enjoy talking to. That's like that's that's the same with me at my store. We have someone who looks like a fucking child. We have some that, damn good steaks. Oh. oh, update on that child-looking person. Apparently, they're twenty-one. What? There's, what? There's, there's, there's someone who, who there's someone who at my job. They're not gonna hear this. I don't care. There's someone who at, who works at who works at my job. They look like they're like fourteen, but they're actually twenty-one. It's the milk they serve in schools, man. What the fuck do you mean by that? It's weird shit. It makes you not. It makes you not age, I guess. Yeah. The milk is too good. <laughs> well, well, wait a minute. I drink the. I drank the chocolate milk at my school. How come I didn't? How come I don't want like a little pedophile's wet dream? <laughs> it's chocolate milk. See, the different kinds of milk they serve at schools do different things. White milk makes you fat, hence me. Chocolate milk just makes you goofy. And strawberry milk makes you look like a child. Anyway, that's the end of part five. What, what, a, what a thing to of, fucking end of on. Batman <laughs> Asylum. I just want some chocolate milk. <laughs> well, <sighs> oh, I can't drink chocolate milk right now. I don't feel the swell. Join us in the <laughs> final next part where we go to <laughs> Ivy and then we end the game. Good night. Okay. Farewell. I need a break. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs>